Hey guys, what's up? This is Jamie and uh, we're going to go through the dock and do a fishing report. I don't know if you guys can hear, but the wind is howling. We've had about four or five days of 25 knot winds and uh, it definitely made the water pretty murky, but the temperature and the weather is absolutely amazing. Um, cold front came through. Our temps right now are probably 75, 80 degrees and uh, there is no humidity. You really can't beat it. Um, the water is definitely pretty murky, but um, we had probably eight guides go out on the inshore side today and a few boats did go offshore, so we're going to uh, check in with them as well. We're looking forward to a really good weekend. We have uh, winds are supposed to die down to about 15 miles per hour and um, change direction a little bit so the water should clear up and uh, we'll be through the wind and into the good weather. How are your day, man? Tell them how we snuck off on all the fish today. With all right, our so basically, on. you just got all this fish to take back home. Got here around like 6 a.m., something like that. Had a great day as always. I've been fishing with Alex since I was, I don't even know, I, since I can remember. And I don't think I've ever had a bad day with him, to be honest. And I'm serious when I say that. Just, it's super enjoyable. His mates, great time. Um, great guy. Never could go wrong, being honest. Uh, great day. Filled up the cooler. And just, yeah. Out some, to the Calyx. What did you guys catch today? We got some yellowtails, kingfish, we got some mud snappers. Up to 15 pounds, big ones. Oh too. yeah. No, we got everything. Wow. So it's a great time as always. Love to, Incredible, love to man. And what was your name? Nico. Nico. Yes, sir. All right, buddy. Well, thank you so much for coming down. We appreciate it. No, thank it. you and thank Alex. Sneaking up on them. All right, guys. So we have Keith Sr. and Keith Jr. And uh, they just got finished fishing with Bill Bassett. And I uh, just wanted to see how you guys did. How was your day? We had a great day. We came down for my dad's 70th birthday from Columbia, Maryland. And I uh, went out with Bill and had a great time back in the back country. Was that your first time doing anything like that? It was, it was. I figured we had a couple of choices of fishing. We could either go in the back country or go out deep sea fishing. And being from Maryland, we can fish in Ocean City deep sea. So decided to try out something different here. That's excellent, man. And I, I heard it's uh, somebody's birthday too, right? Yes, mom. Yeah, it's 70th birthday yesterday. Hey, happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you for coming to Bud and Mary's to celebrate it. And are you guys, I, I mean, I know you guys obviously slayed the snapper here, but look at this thing. It's huge. It's Captain Bill. Hello. Captain Bill. All right, so we're here with the famous Bill Bassett, and he is sharpening his knife. They just got back from their trip today. Bill, why is a sharp knife important? So I don't cut my fingers off. <laughs> Doll knife, you'll cut yourself. How'd you guys do out there today, Bill? We had a great day. We caught a lot of, uh, we caught like a dozen, 15 snooks. A little Goliath grouper we released. And um, we caught a lemon, a nice big mangrove snapper today. Got some really nice size ones here. Man size. They're big enough to eat a small child. It sure is. The thing is almost as big as your arm. <laughs> well, wow. It's like, that's the way we like to catch Monsters. them. Monsters. Here's some lunkers. Should have seen the ones that got away. <laughs> like that one. Like that, this one almost got away <laughs> twice. Now those are big, big mangrove snappers. About as big as we catch them in the back country. How are the seas today? Uh, a little choppy, but you know, we run around in the bay back there. It's pretty easy to get around. You just run the, shot, run the edge of the flats so you don't beat, beat the clients up. Catch the teeth there for my kids to see their teeth. Okay, so we got the crew from Chicago here. They just got finished Done fishing it. on the real McCoy. Look at this guy here. Who, What's, what's your name, sir? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's working hard. He's working hard. Hey, what how'd you guys do today? Fantastic. Great day out on the real McCoy. Good energy, good vibes, good fishing. Can't wait to come back. Where are you guys from? Chicago. Chicago. What do you think of this weather? A lot better than Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> I highly recommend. A little windy, but we'll take it. <laughs> and so you guys heard a double header sailfish? Double header, same time. Steve O, Big O. Real demand. Was that your first time ever catching a sailfish? Oh yeah. oh yeah. What did you think? 
She's got a little fight to her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's got a little fight to her. Is there some jumping Still involved? Yeah, a little bit here and there. Yep. <laughs> There's a show. Yeah, they get after it. Awesome, man. Well, hey, we appreciate you guys coming out. Thank you. Anytime. Thank you. Can't wait to come back. Can't wait to come back. Can't wait to come back. All right, so we had a good time out there with all those guys on the guide dock. Good day fishing inshore and offshore. We're going to go check out the Miss Almirada and see what happened over there. See you guys at the dock. Happy customers. Yes. Woo! Hey, 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 just try to corral these fish, all right, guys, please? Because that bird's not come down to get Come get them. There goes a rock star. Who got that? Where'd that come from today? Whoa! That's a big mountain. Big girl. I mean, you're a pretty big dude. How big are you, bro? 6'8". <laughs> 6'8". That fish is about half the size of you. <laughs> so tell us about your day, dude. Oh, it's, it's, it explains it all right here. I know. It all up. And you guys had only, what, like uh, 10 or 10 people or so? Yeah, right? 8 today. That's awesome. Looks like you kept them busy. Kept us entertained. <laughs> Say a, a bucket full of fish, big rock stars in there, a bunch of tails, movie stars. Do you guys prefer to clean your fish up by yourself? Yeah. Or you guys eat the whole fish? The whole, the whole fish, the yellow tail, the whole thing get cooked. You got to eat the eyes out too. Do you really? Yeah. 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 Good you what does it taste like? Eyes taste like? It it's really good. Oh, I need to a lot of fish dip. What's that? That's a lot of fish. That's a lot of fish dip. Right here. Sure. Blue Runners? Yeah. Nice. You guys know Jamaica Mike? Yeah, I know. Yeah, he makes, the, he makes the fish at the sea, man. He kills it. Look at this. We got Jamaica Mike over here. This guy is one of the hardest working people that are here, man. I have a lot of respect for this dude. How you doing, Mike? Yeah, man, I'm a good man. Yeah. Everybody, correct? Everybody good? Yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah, man. Right now, I'm up on the hustling, you know? Yeah, man. This one of my favorite boats right here. Yo, I love to watch boats. When I'm here, the best place on the planet. You see me? It's yeah, Mike. Yeah, so nice. Yeah, so nice. Yeah, so nice. Let's smack the light button. Smash the light button. Yeah, so nice. Yeah, so nice. Yeah, so nice. Ding, ding, ding. Slash the light button. You see me? Boda Mary, best place on the earth, on planet Earth. Love Boda Mary. Right now. And you know, earlier I did sing a song about Boda Mary, you know, it go like this. It was all a dream. I used to read Boda Mary magazine. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Just another day at Bud and Mary's. Alright guys, well thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time. Make sure you like and subscribe.